this is JP from Northern Lights over Arkham. This time I'll be trying out Folk Leadership deck against Claw Expert with the Masters of Evil modular set. Uh, let's see what I put into Hulk's Leadership deck first. So, because Hulk has so, such a small hand size in Hero mode, I tried to build the deck with uh, something to ease playing the allies. Also, to utilize many allies to, for example, play strength in numbers to boost Hulk's hand size up so he can do more things in one turn. I also wanted to try out the new resourceful card to see uh, how, how that works. It's a bit special because it's, it's uh, either a wild resource or it's an extra resource if you play it onto the table. Many times with Hulk there seems to be overflowing cards in your hand that you can just play so maybe with the help of resourceful I can just play them onto the table and have resources to play the cards that would not usually have the uh, resources at hand to play. Also Helicarrier uh, Quinjet and Avengers Mansion uh, will help uh, play out uh, some of the cards in Hulk, like all of the allies and the more costly event cards. But let's see how Hulk does in leadership aspect against Claw Expert, so let's get started. If you like my content, hit the subscribe button so you don't miss anything. Okay, so first let's finish up the claw setup. So uh, we discard cards until we hit a minion. Uh, so we start the game uh, with Tiger Shark in play. And then let's uh, flip this card and draw our opening hand of five cards. So we get Falcon to the rescue, uh, Thunderclap, Wonder Man, and Squirrel Girl. Mm, I think there's uh, <laughs> way too many allies to play right at the start. Uh, Falcon actually could be useful, so we could get rid of the Immortal Claw. Oh yeah, I forgot to add the acceleration to open up that. And also, he could uh, he could also help getting rid of the defense network. So I think. Well, let's see. Uh, I'll discard all of this and see what I draw. So we get helicarrier, uh, power of leadership, unstoppable force, and Avengers tower. So. Uh, uh, I think we're not playing Unstoppable Force, so I'll uh, use Bruce Banner's ability to draw a card. Okay, uh, we get the uh, Limitless. That changes things a bit more. Okay, I think I know the game plan for this turn, so uh, I think we'll play down uh, Falcon. I'll use the power of leadership. Uh, oh yeah. Let's back up a bit. I need still need to discard one card. Uh, yeah. So uh, I'll discard the unstoppable force. Okay. Uh, I think we'll flip to Hulk. I play the Helicarrier with the limitless strength. Uh, then I'll use Helicarrier and Power of Leadership and Avengers Tower to play down Falcon. And then uh, let's do Falcon's response. So we look at the top three cards of the encounter deck. And for each treachery uh, looked at this way, remove one threat from a machine. And we get two. So, okay, let's see. Uh, first boost card will be Melter. And first, 
that's not good. Well, we're getting the gang up. And also we're getting Sonic Boom. So I think, yeah, so we just need to defend with Hulk for the attack. Let's try to remember that. So uh, we remove two threats from machine. I'll remove them from uh, Immortal Claw. Mm. I think Falcon will uh, thwart the Immortal Claw away. And then uh, Hulk will hit Tiger Shark for three damage. And that is our turn. We draw back up to four. Uh, we get suborbital leap, uh, thunderclap, genius, and downtime. So uh, we can play suborbital leap with uh, uh, thunderclap and genius, or we could play thunderclap next turn to get rid of tiger shark and all that good stuff. But let's see uh, how the turn goes. So we ready up. Uh, then we add one threat to the main scheme. Uh, Claw attacks. I will defend with Hulk. Uh, oh yeah. Uh, forgot that this will be a boost icon so we don't get the gang up. Oh well. Uh, exhaust each ally uh, you control and plus one so law deals two damage but I defend for three so no da damage is dealt and I'll exhaust each ally I control. Then Tiger Shark hits for three and when Tiger Shark hits uh, he gets a top status. Okay so the encounter card is uh, Well, uh, we just exhaust each character, so this doesn't do anything. And that's the villain phase, so let's go to the next hero phase. Okay, so uh, let's see what we can do in this hero phase. Uh, we could uh, get rid of the defense network this turn. I think I'll do that with the Thunderclap and Genius. Okay, so uh, let's spend Thunderclap and Genius to play Suborbital Leap. So we remove three from here. This gets discarded. And I will play Downtime with the Helicarrier. And I think that's our turn. Uh, we're ready up. We draw back up to four. Now we get a rapid response, walk eye, make the call and limitless strength. And we go to the villain phase, we add one threat here. Uh, claw attacks, I won't defend with Hulk and we get three damage. And Tiger Shark will also hit for three damage, so I'll just take it with Hulk. And he, he gets the tough, uh, which he already has. And encounter card is uh, Masters of Evil. Uh, when revealed, discard cards from the encounter deck until a Masters of Evil minion is discarded. Put that minion into play, engage with the first player. So let's discard some cards. Well, at least we got rid of both of the advances. And we get the radioactive man. And that is the villain phase. So let's go to the next hero phase. Let's see. Uh, we could make the call and. Play Squirrel Girl to get rid of Tiger Shark's stuff. Mm. I don't think Hawkeye is that uh, necessary. Yeah, let's do that. Uh, Squirrel Girl can be a blocker after that. 
So mm, we play skir uh, make the call and play squirrel girl uh, with one less. Oh yeah, we can't use heli carrier. Okay, let's think this through. Uh, I think I'll, I'll leave Squirrel Girl into the Discord and I'll play Hawkeye with the limitless strength. And let's get Hawkeye's arrows out. And then mm, uh, Hawkeye will hit for uh, one here, uh, removing the top, and then mm, uh, Hulk will defeat Tiger Shark. Uh, I'll play rapid response with the hel uh, helicarrier and uh, make the call. And I think Falcon will uh, towards for two. And I think I'll flip back to uh, Bruce Banner. And that is my turn. I'll draw back up to five. Ready up and let's start the villain phase. Oh, let's see, we got resourceful uh, Quinjet, strength, immovable object, and crushing blow. So we can start smashing next, next turn with Hulk. Uh, we add two threat to the main sheam, uh, claw sheams for two plus. Uh, Nothing. So two and a radioactive man. Seems for one. And the encounter card is Inner Demons. Uh, okay, so uh, change form, flip your identity. Then, if you are Hulk, exhaust your hero, discard this obligation. Okay. Well, uh, we were planning on healing, but at least we got the <laughs> uh, five hand, five card hand. Uh, so that is that turn. Uh, let's see what we can do in the next hero phase. Uh, so now we have a lot of choices. I think we'll uh, use Helicarrier and Strength to play down Immovable Object on Hulk. So we get uh, four hit points and we have a Retaliate one. And then I think uh, Hoka and Falcon both will thwart and they will remove them. Actually, yeah, we don't want to let that advance, so they will remove uh, three from here. Uh, let's see. Let's uh, use Crushing Blow, deal uh, 3 damage to Radioactive Man, so we could possibly kill it next turn, and uh, we have to discard Quinjet, and we're ready up, uh, we draw back up to 4, 
and we get uh, Boundless Rage, uh, Resourceful, Strength in Numbers, and Maria Hill. Okay, uh, let's go to the villain phase. We add two threat here. Uh, claw attacks. I will uh, uh, take the hit with Hulk. Claw hits for four. And Radioactive Man will hit for one. Uh, yeah. We discard one card at random. And we discard Boundless Rage. Well, that was the one that I uh, least wanted to play. And also we do the retaliate damage on both Claw and Radioactive Man. Let's not forget about that. Uh, encounter card is uh, Exhaustion. Mm. Exhaust your identity card and search is Code of Card. Discard an upgrade or support to control. I think we'll discard downtime. And that is the turn, so let's go to the next hero phase. Okay, let's see what we can do here. Uh, I'll Play Maria Hill. I draw a card. Uh, do I play Strength in Numbers or do I do something else? Mm, uh, I think I will. Yeah, I, I really need to thwart, so I'll thwart for two from here. Then I will thwart for uh, one from here, and that defeats Hawkeye. I will trigger rapid response, put Hawkeye into play. Actually, hmm. Uh, let's do this the other way. So I won't trigger the rapid response yet. I think uh, we want to work more with uh, Hawkeye. So Hawkeye uh, would have been defeated earlier. Somehow I want to add more health. So yeah, let's uh, back up. Uh, we'll use the rapid response on Hawkeye. I totally uh, missed the, uh, that only the, uh, that Falcon only has only has uh, three health. Yeah. So we deal one damage to Hawkeye, and I think. Should I use the strength in numbers or? Uh, I'll use the strength in numbers to draw one card and see what we get. Well, uh, nothing useful. That is our turn. We have to discard our hand and uh, ready up. Uh, we draw back up to four. Hulk smash. Oh, yeah. Um, that would have been removed when the Immortal Claw got removed. Uh, so we have got uh, Hulk Smash, Banner's Laboratory, the Power of Leadership and Resource. Uh, the villain phase starts, uh, we go back up to 5. 
Call attacks. Uh, I will take it with Hulk. Uh, claw hits for four. Radioactive man hits for one. Oh yeah, and uh, let's do the retaliates. And we discard one card from hand. So we discard Banner's Laboratory. At least we have the Hulk Smash for next turn. Uh, yeah, uh, let's draw the encounter card and it is under fire. So it searches and we reveal another one. We get Whirlwind uh, through uh, Hawkeye will shoot Whirlwind. Then uh, we get the search card, uh, Illegal Arms Factory. Place an additional one threat here, so there's four. Okay, so that is the villain phase. Let's go to the next hero phase. Let's see. Uh, so we could just uh, Hulk smash a Whirlwind, and uh, as we can pay it with only strength, uh, it gains overkill. I think I'll do that. So we use the Heli Carrier, Resourceful, and our leadership to play Hulk smash. Hulk hits for 13. And we'll hit Whirlwind. So uh, we deal 9 damage to Claw with Overkill. And then uh, I think we need to just get rid of the uh, Radioactive Man. So uh, both Hawkeye and Maria Hill will hit the Radioactive Man to defeat it. And that will mean we have a hard time. Uh, because that will advance and... Well, it can't be helped. And... Uh, we have to go heal, so... We'll flip. And we uh, ready up. We draw back up to five. Uh, villain phase starts. Oh yeah, let's see what our cards. Uh, crushing blow, energy queen, jet make the call of strength in numbers. Okay. So uh, we add two threat to the main shim. It will advance. And we discard cards and we'll, we hit the minion. Okay, so we get the weapons runner and put it into play. Okay, I will shoot the weapons runner. And close schemes for two plus one, so three. And we get an acceleration token. And we get two encounter cards. The first one is uh, Shadow of the Past, so we get to see what Hulk's uh, nemesis does, so we get Abomination. So Abomination is a forced response after Abomination attacks you, discard the top card of your deck. If it's a strength resource, uh, if, a strength, uh, if a physical resource was discarded this way, take 2 damage. Then we get uh, total destruction. Uh, we are <laughs> really... Hurting with all of these 
uh, side seams. Mm, then we put uh, three copies of Clash of the Titans into the encounter deck, and it does. When revealed, uh, the enemy with the highest attack attacks the hero or ally with the highest attack. First player decides dice. If no attack was made this way, this card gains search. Okay. And that was uh, just the first one. Still have another encounter card, and yeah, Hawkeye will shoot two damage to Abomination. And the second card is uh, Solid Sound Body. That's the Claw, and Claw gains Retaliate, and we can get uh, rid of that with uh, spending resource, uh, all kinds of resources, and that is the villain phase. Let's go to the next hero phase. Okay, let's see. Uh, we definitely need to heal. Uh, let's first look. Okay. Uh, yeah, so we heal. Uh, I think I'll play uh, Falcon with Make the Call. I'll use Queen, Jet, and Strength in Numbers. We really need to get rid of some uh, of these side schemes. Then we have the Crushing Blow. We can use the heli carry for that. Okay, so let's resolve uh, Falcon. Uh, we hit three treacheries, and we have uh, Gang Up and Clash of Titans for uh, close boost cards. And Advance is the next one. I think we'll do it tactically and won't go to hero mode. But yeah, so we can remove three threat from Sheems. Uh, for each treasure look at this way, remove one threat from a Sheems. So, as I understand, I have to remove it from the same place. I uh, really think we need to slow down the. Uh, threat, so we'll remove the Masters of Evil to get rid of one of these. And uh, yeah, I, I really need to flip, but I can't. This, uh, I think we may lose this uh, turn, but let's see. Uh, okay, Let's just flip and Falcon will. Uh, yeah, Falcon will dwarf for two here. Uh, Hawkeye will get defeated and hit for one here. Uh, I'll use Helicarrier to play Crushing Blow. And we'll deal... Okay, so... Mm -hmm. We deal 4 damage. Uh, 3 damage here, so uh, Hawkeye did 1 damage. No, uh, it... It's already de there, so uh, we defeat Abomination. And that is the turn. Uh, we drop back up to 4, we get an extra encounter card. Okay. 
we ready up. So we have a uh, boundless rage, unstoppable horse, uh, sub orbital leap, and Hulk smash. Okay, uh, villain phase we had uh, two threats here. So we are at five. I think we will just lose for the. Uh, yeah. Oh no. Actually, uh, claw attacks. I will take it with Hulk. Uh, one plus three, so four. Yeah, I, I forgot that I dodged the. Uh, I dodged the advance because I took one extra card here. And counter card is, and we get an extra one. Uh, first one is gang up, uh, claw attacks, I'll defend with Falcon. Uh, Falcon takes two, and is defeated. Next one, uh, weapons runner search. Uh, either spend... Yeah, I, I don't have... So, I don't have the necessary resources to discard, so I have to exhaust my characters and inner demons. Okay. And we have to discard two cards from my hand. Boundless Rage. I unfortunately don't have the resources to play Hawk Smash. Okay, we discard those. And that is the uh, villain phase, so let's go to the next hero phase and see if we can climb out of this pit. Okay. Mm. Let's see here. Uh, oh yeah, I forgot to add one damage from the retaliate and uh, Hulk got a hit. Uh, uh, yeah, there's. Uh, I'll just use uh, Bruce Banner's ability. Okay. Uh, Let's play the laboratory. I think I'll have to flip and hope for the best. So I ready up. I draw back up to four. So we add two threat here. Low attacks, I will have to defend. I put the weapons runner into play. I take no damage. Uh, the weapons runner hit me for 1 1. And both take uh, retaliate damage and also claw took retaliate damage. And let's see if we can survive the encounter cards. So the first one is a Sonic Converter. Uh, that's Claw, Radioactive Man. Okay, so we survived this turn, but <laughs> not looking good. So let's see if the game ends on the next turn. Okay. Uh, uh, well, I will... Uh, I will play Wonder Woman. Uh, <laughs> Wonder Man. And... <laughs> Uh, nothing to play. Yeah, let's uh, to the rescue. Uh, two threat from here. 
Yeah, we're we're just dead. Uh, yeah, let's uh, die fighting. No point in sweating out or anything like that. So. Uh, Ready up, draw back up the four. Uh, villain phase two, threat here. Uh, blow attacks, wonder man will defend. Uh, pegs, sound damage, and radioactive man will defeat Hulk. Unfortunately, and that is the game. So uh, it went well at, until a point, and then <laughs> everything fell apart. I think I'll really need to fine-tune the deck a bit more but uh, I'm still liking uh, playing Hulk with leadership I think uh, the deck just needs some work I really did not do any net decking to build the deck I just tried to utilize the resource cheapening cards to get stuff onto the table but uh, it wasn't enough this time. I think we got a bit unlucky with some of the encounter cards and got like tons of uh, side shims in play all the time. But yeah, uh, I I will see if I try this again or uh, will I try a different aspect of the next Hulk playthrough. But thanks for watching and until next time.